Hello, welcome to Blender Time. Thanks for tuning in. First, I would like to thank all the creators of these beautiful matte caps. You people are truly awesome. To find custom matte caps, I come to this page. The license of the matte caps here should be public domain CC0. I put the link of this page in the description below. Scroll and find the matte cap you like. Special thanks to Weevun. Hope I pronounce your name correct. Usually there is link you can click to download the matte cap. Once downloaded, unzip the file if necessary. Here are the extracted file from the zip that I have downloaded. As you can see, we have some EXR and JPEG files. The JPEG files are for preview. We want to use the EXR for our matte cap. In this example, I want to use the Albert 08 matte cap. So I copy the Albert 08 EXR file. Now I navigate to Blender 2.8 installation folder. Double click on 2.80 folder. Data files. Studio lights. Matte cap. Here is where we will put our matte caps. I paste the EXR file here. Close window. After pasting the matte cap, I launch Blender. If you have Blender opened before you place the matte cap, you need to quit Blender. Then relaunch Blender. Now, I go to Shading. Matte cap. Click on Window. The Albert 08 matte cap is now in Blender. To remove matte cap. First, quit Blender. Go back to the folder where we placed the matte cap. Select the matte cap. Delete it. Launch Blender. Done. This is how easy it is to add and remove custom matte caps. If you have questions, feel free to leave it in the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching. Hope to see you in the next video. Have a great day.